Hey y'all! What's up? Let me turn this music down. Um, I just left the doctors. Demarcus and I, we just left the doctors. Noah is doing good. Everything's looking good. And I'm back to two weeks, not one. Shout out to me and my diet. Um, but yeah, I'm about to go in at home, Lord. Pray for me, because I don't want to be in here all day. And I'm really just looking for a little side table to go between the crib and the glider. But hopefully I don't see too much. So yeah, let's go in here. We'll see. We're not putting up a Christmas tree this year, and I'm so sad. I'm so tempted just to buy like a little small one. But it's the same amount of work, getting it out and all of that. So I'm gonna go in here for what I came for. So I'm looking for a table, like I said, and some other little stuff for the nursery, like to go on her nightstand. This is my favorite house. I love it. I love the store, but. I just don't know. I'm gonna go look at the pillows too. So I'm gonna look for the tables first. Tables, then uh, come back over here because I don't really think I need anything in particular. I'm not even fully focused, am I? Maybe, I don't know. All right, let's go. Y'all, I am turning into a mommy for real. I feel like a granny. So I haven't really been working since uh, I'm further along, hence Noah. But, so I've been home and really just focusing on my schoolwork. But I this cleaning is starting to become an obsession. So when I first moved out, I had slight OCD. <laughs> Mama, wouldn't you say? But um, I'm just, it's getting obsessive. I just want to clean everything, but people call it nesting, I think. Comment below if you nested, if you wanted everything clean and everything in order and everything a certain way. I'm already like that, a little bit controlling, just a little, but these last couple weeks, it's been bad. Like, I've never cleaned this much ever. And it's like I'm finding something to do even when I should be chilling or studying or anything. Pray for me. Y'all, so I got a package today and I'm like, what did I order? I do not remember ordering anything because it's from Amazon. And it's Noah's book. I was so excited about ordering this. Little Leaders, Bold Women in Black History. Vashti Harrison. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. How stinking cute is that? Hmm. I had to come eat me a little snack. My breakfast was not enough. I had a vanilla protein smoothie with a little bit of oatmeal and it was not enough. Hungry. Just a small banana and a little peanut butter. I've been on this low carb, high protein diet. Bananas are not that low in carbs if you care, but it's been going pretty good. My blood sugar is regulated. That's great. But hey, y'all, <laughs> after my snack, it is Thursday. And yeah, it's Thursday. The week's almost over. But I'm about to twist my hair. I thought I'd bring y'all on here. I haven't twisted my hair in a while because I had those braids. And Nima, it's been worse than I don't want you. Come up here, say hey. Say hey, vlog. Look, say hey, vloggy. She just wanted to get up here, spoiled. All right, go get it, go get your toy. 
Well, I'm about to twist my hair. Um, I'm gonna show y'all the products I use. The first product I use is this Garnier Hole Blends. Can y'all see it? Can y'all see it? It's just a leave-in conditioner. And then I got a cream that I use. If I can reach it. Ooh, no, it's in the way. Shea Moisture Coconut Curling Enhancing Smoothie. I use that. Then I lock it in with a little Eco. I don't switch up my Eco. I know a lot of people use all different kinds of Eco. No, I don't switch mine up. I've been using the green, which is the olive oil, and I'm still gonna keep using it. They make so many now, this works for me, so. Okay, y'all, so now I got it sectioned off in four little sections, four chunky, messy sections, not nothing with no parts and all that. Um, I just break down the section and start twisting. I use my cream first, and then I put my gel on top of it. It's not no particular order, it's got a little bit of hair. I like mine chunky, because I feel like my twist out comes out better when I do it like that. I know a lot of people make their skinny, so they can wear them, but I don't mind wearing my big chunky sealy twist out. I mean, I got natural hair, hey preparing my hair and I'm keeping it in probably until the weekend so yeah so then I just start twisting um once I sectioned it off y'all my hair's got it so much longer honey I can get it all in the clip <laughs> who's excited I am but yeah so just take a little product I'm not heavy-handed on the products either I don't feel like I am I know some people twist me dripping dripping and got white stuff caked up all on them I don't like it I don't want to look like that I mean I'm about to go out so I'll just put the cream then put some gel on top twist her up two pieces this little back got so long, I can actually get a twist back here. For a minute, I was putting a little finger pull back here and then twisting the rest. Then I take some gel and put it on top of the twist. Lock it in. <laughs> you girl got a little baby twist back here. All right, all right, all right. I'm finished. Let's get them edges sullied. Just with a little eco. I'm gonna spray some oil on it too. Um, I don't got it in this room, so. And my camera's on the little tripod, so. Yeah, I'm all done. I'll wear these for uh, the next couple days and then I'll take them out on the weekend. This one is too skinny. Who do it go by? Yeah, they about to have to double up. I'm gonna have to take this out and double up. But yeah, these are the twist. They wet, but I'm going out with them because I gotta go and go to Ulta and get back. Y'all. Ulta is having a bomb deal. Um, Anastasia Beverly Hills, what I was saying earlier, the lipsticks that I use, they had 50% off the liquid lipsticks. So I got three colors. I got a color Catherine, um, Milkshake, can't really see it, and Spicy. So I got three. So I'll show you those. I'll take them out of the package and show them. And then I got some Baby Shower gifts in the mail. I don't think it has a name on it, but somebody said no. I opened one, so I'll show you. It's some little hats, and I'm assuming it's a little outfit. So when I go in there, I'll show you. But let me open these, and then I'll go in the kitchen. Yeah. So this is what um, somebody sent. I don't think it has a name on it because I looked on the little um, gift receipt that's in the package. But this is the one I opened in the car, so I'm gonna open them and show y'all. But I don't think there's a name on it. So whoever sent it, thank you so much if you see the video. And if you didn't, I'll just shout out everybody at the baby shower. Oh, we got something yesterday too. We got the wipe warmer. Miss Emma gave it to me. So I wrote her name on the box so that I could remember because I threw the other stuff away. So we got a wipe warmer yesterday. And then today we got some little cute baby hats. <laughs> Look at the hats. OMG. They're cute. Some little hats. Let me check. Oh yeah, Paralysis sent these. Uh, how cute so thank you for Alice I don't know if you'll see us Elizabeth you'll probably see it so thank y'all so much we appreciate y'all the cute little hats oh my gosh some cute little neutral mittens oh they're so cute I love it I love it it's like Christmas oh some cute bibs oh this stuff is on the registry too well duh actually <laughs> I didn't know they wanted, I didn't know they wanted it some cute bibs, the little snap ones. She won't use these for a while, but oh no, they got smaller sizes, adjustable. Cute little bibs. And one more. Oh, the bibs to match the clothes. And the bibs to match the clothes. These match. So cute. Thank y'all so much. I'm getting excited. So I'll put this with her stuff. Can you ever hear him? 
fast asleep. Guess what I'm doing? Still studying. Like, really? Come on next Tuesday. Like, I'm done. I'm done studying. All right, bye, I gotta go back. Hey y'all, it's Sunday and I just left church. So get this, I was just having a conversation with Casey. Y'all know Casey, my sister. I was just having a conversation with her about acts of kindness and how if someone pays for me, if someone pays for me, I try to pay for the people behind me, blase, blase. Well, she was telling me about a story where one of her friends, uh, they told her the total and she was like, oh, no. So I'm at KFC, get me a meal or whatever. The girl, I got to the window, I was like, oh, she was like, oh, um, the people in front of you pay for your food. And I was like, oh, okay, great. That's awesome. I'm going to pay for the car behind me. She said, oh, you might not want to do it. It's $40. I said, no, you know what? I still want to do it. She was like, oh my gosh, that's so nice. Do you really? I was like, yeah, I still want to do it. So I still paid for the car behind me for $40. But it just goes to show that you never know. And it's just keep it going. Don't get to uh, register our counter and don't keep it going. Keep it going. Acts of kindness. It's a blessing. Like, y'all. Study Still. Last night studying. Pray for me. But yeah, I want to come on here and end the vlog before I get too engrossed. It's 12.05. Um, now Monday, but the end of Sunday for me. Um, yeah, I wanted to come on here and end the vlog and say thank you so much for watching. And to I need you all to subscribe and like and share and tell your friends about it and your mama and everybody else. You know the rules. Um, yeah, thank you so much, and I'll see you all next week. Bye.